Myelofibrosis is one of the most severe disorders uh, in the group of myeloproliferative neoplasms and myelofibrosis is very frequently associated with constitutional symptoms, fatigue, night sweat, symptoms from the enlarged spleen. The quality of life of this patient is a problem because of the splenic size, which is large, because of the fatigue, because of the anemia, because of the bone pains they cannot function properly. Day and night, he is feeling his symptoms. They will not go away. Unfortunately, they usually are on the increase, gradually, day by day. This is a very exciting time uh, to be a treating physician for patients with myeloproliferative neoplasms and especially with myelofibrosis. Because of the discovery of the JAK2 mutation in 2008, the new WHO classification of MPN, and more recently the approval of this new JAK1, JAK2 inhibitor, ruxolitinib or JAKABI, that's giving us a, an opportunity to change the natural history of patients with myelofibrosis started my very first trial and the spleen reduced in size to near normal within perhaps two to three months or even possibly less. This is in big contrast to patients treated in the past with conventional therapy where they would have still a lot of symptoms, uh, the medication would work very slowly and typically patients uh, would not have an improvement in quality of life within a short period of time. So I think Really, uh, with the new JAK2 inhibitor, Jacavia, we are seeing much quicker response in terms of reduction in the size of the spleen, in terms of improvement of quality of life, and most importantly, patients feel better. Mm -hmm.